In this video, you're going to learn how to pair the OU cam right now. How are we doing, everyone? This is Dario from Media Box ENT, and you're going to learn now how to uh, pair this camera. I'll show you how the whole thing works. Simple and easy. All right, so what we get with the uh, hiding camera 1080p uh, Wi Fi 2.4 gigahertz. So we get the camera, real tiny, small. So right over here, we install the micro SD card. Here we have the length, the night vision. Right over there is the LED, and it blinks every few seconds when it's pair power. And the reset switch is right here on the side. That's the reset switch. And this is where you power up your camera. I would recommend when you get this the first time, plug it in and leave it there for a while and to recharge. See, right now there's a red dot. It means it requires uh, charging. So when you get this, you need to reset it. The way to reset the camera, you're going to use this pin. You're going to insert it over here. You will feel a click. All right. So right there hold it for a few seconds all right we see right there blinking all right so i'm going to hold it you see it change i'm going to let it go and if you see see went off you need to wait and now reset so in the beginning so the camera is reset now you get the cable uh, USB cable, micro USB, so you can charge this with uh, your telephone, charger, computer. And it comes with all the magnetic pieces, even it comes with the cleaner. And we have here the magnetic part and 3M sticker. You take this anywhere, you can even put it around your car. And the camera, see, will automatic stick anywhere. Now, I'm going to teach you how to pair the camera the most easy way. So now I'm going to teach you how to pair the camera. Simple and easy. Now, grab the manual and grab your reader from your telephone, the QR reader, and scan. I use devices right over here, Android right over here. Download and install the application. You have the memory, you can install the memory. All right. So we start the application. It's the same name as you see in the camera. And that's the first thing we get, right? Now, the camera, make sure this reset in there, all right? So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to bring this down, and I'm going to go into my network settings. I'm going to search. I'm going to press search for my Wi-Fi, and we need to look, and that's BM, and it will give you that strength of numbers. I'm going to click there. It's going to connect. I'm going to come back. Come back over here. Hit the camera. So press plus. It automatically will get the message that there are no connection, no internet connection. Now, some of the phone automatically will, will reset itself or go back to the previous network because there is no connection on the internet. Like my phone, if I take too long, it will disconnect from the camera. It will go back to the 5 gigahertz, all right? So if that had in mind, then maybe you need to reconnect. So we click right there. Password of the camera is 1, 2, 3. Oop, not a 4. Go back, 3. And then we save. And now the camera is going to connect. It didn't switch to 2.25 gigahertz. I think it did. I want to show you that. You see that? Because that's my phone will do that. And I think maybe your phone can do that. So what we're going to do, we go back. All right. And we're going to push it back again. We go back here and we look for the camera. Once again, pay attention to that. Very important. So now I'm connected back again. Go there. And now I'm online. You see right over here, the camera is online. If I press here, that's normal. 
but I need to connect to the uh, to my network. So you see here my hand. Yes, I'm here. We're gonna come back over here. All right. So while we are here, we're gonna press the wheel, and we need to change the Wi-Fi settings. Go Wi-Fi settings. Manage the Wi-Fi. And look for your network. 2.4 network only. All right. So that's my 2.4 network. All right. So I'm gonna enter my password of my network. We have to make sure we're still connected, and I think I'm not. Again, see, it got disconnected. That's, I think that's my phone, but just in case it happened to you, I need to go back again, because I took too long. That's the tricky thing, you have to make sure you do that. So, I'm already connected, let's go back and let's do the same step I was doing there. It should be fine now. Wi-Fi settings. Okay, search for my Wi-Fi. 2.4 and not enter the password and connect and now the camera is going to reset so you need to have a little patience here if we look the camera the LED lights here not blinking when it goes black okay it's blinking right now so we need to wait it's blinking green so we need to wait to reset I'm connected to the 5 gigahertz so now it blinks is slow you see it was blinking fast and can we catch that now yes to see that it blinks every few seconds yep I'm connected now now we'll go back here I'm online, so I'm going to click here, and you're in. Now, what you have to remember is this, some of the phones automatic, because there is a local connection between the camera and your phone, if my phone, it will now find any connection to the internet, it will default back again to the previous network, and my previous network is a 5 gigahertz network. So what I did, went back and reconnected again because it takes too long. My phone, it will default that. So it happened to you, you have to do that process. Now, at this point, the camera knows the camera itself already connect to the local network. I don't need to change that anymore. I can turn off my phone if I want, and this will still record it. This will still connect it to, to the 2.4 network. But this is a trick thing you have to do. Make sure you do that first. And then you okay. And then if this blinks every few seconds, you connect it. Done at that point. Uh, you can change. Now from here, we can change the notification. And all the settings, I would recommend to change your password. You see security code. And the time zone. And change that. And from here, you can format the, uh, the memory card. When you are in the main screen, from here, we can take a picture. If you sit right there, so I'm perfect right there. You can take a picture and we can listen to it. If we go, hello, 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 was perfect. There is no speaker, that's for the use speaker. So if you play here, you will hear whatever the camera is actually recording. We can take a picture right now or record it right on my phone, or we can, after you see, we take a picture, we can record, see full the screen. We can change from HD to a standard to a smooth, depends on your internet connection. If you see the camera works great, the only thing you have to do, make sure you follow those steps and you always will be connected and you have to do this only once, one is done, that's it. At that point, now you can take this in your car. People ask me, can I take this even if I have no internet connection? Yes, as long as you pair it for the first time and you configure your memory, you configure everything, you can take the camera with you and when you bring it back and it will automatically connect to the network and it will work as the way it used to be from the beginning okay and that's it with this we finish the tutorial how to pair the, this small spy camera